Do you have the yacht light and you can't get the alarm clock to work properly? Well, I got tons of people asking me questions every day about this. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. We're going to show you how to do this video right now. Let's try to set the alarm on the yacht light. Let's go. Hey, thanks for tuning in for another episode of your review channel. I've been getting a lot of questions regarding the yacht light. I've tried to address them as, as best I can through the messages, but it's getting complicated. So a lot of people are asking me how to set the damn alarm. It's very confusing. There are no instructions. It's an absolute nightmare. <clears throat> I keep getting constant questions. How do you turn it on? How do you shut it off? It doesn't shut off. How do you, how do you, how do you set it? It's just absolutely, it's a nightmare. You got to kind of play with the buttons a million, million times to try to figure it out. And honestly, I'm even confused and I've been playing with it for a while. <clears throat> so basically how it works. So I'm going to try to teach you. So pay attention. I know this is, this is very complicated. So let's try to go over this and just give you a basic idea of what's happening. So this is the time. Okay. Temperature, date, you have all that. So we went over that in the other videos. I'll leave a link on top so you can see how to set the time, how to set the date. I went all, I went through all that and that's all set. So that's pretty easy. The hard part is if you want to set the alarm and it's really not an alarm clock. So it's really, really complicated. So there's like no really easy snooze button. So you can set it off for snooze. You can set it off for alarm. <clears throat> you can have alarm with no snooze, alarm with snooze with the control, how long you want the snooze to be off for. I mean, time you figure out where the button is, you're gonna be awake anyway, so I'm not really sure how good the snooze button really is. Again, it's really not designed for like an alarm clock in my opinion. It's really just a side thing they threw in there. There's some crazy musical tone comes off of this for the music, I don't know. But I'm gonna show you how to set the time, I mean the alarm, <clears throat> and then we're gonna go through how to shut off, the, how to set the the time, the snooze, and also and how to set the, the, the time for the snooze, how to shut off the snooze, and how to shut off the, the alarm totally, because people don't know how to shut the alarm off. You know, you can set it, then how do you shut the damn thing off? You, you gotta go through a sequence of buttons, and you gotta press this button, and that button, it's an absolute disaster. But I'm gonna try to do best, my, the best I can to show you how to set the alarm, if I can remember how to do it now. Hey, I just wanna take a quick moment here to thank you very much for watching my video. I do appreciate it very much. I hope you're learning how to set the alarm in the outlight. light. It's a real pain that you know what, but let's get to it. Don't forget to subscribe, it does help me. Let's go. So in the back here, you have, we talked about these buttons before. Again, this is for Celsius and, and, and um, temperature. Uh, so Fahrenheit and Celsius, that's what that's for. Um, this is the set button, this is the manual button, and you have the up and down buttons, okay? So a set button is for the time, so we got that. But the M button, let's touch the M button and see what happens to the front here. So the M button, see what it does? <clears throat> so this little clock means alarm clock. Hit the M button again. It shuts off the, it, it's off the alarm setting. Hit the M button again, it's back on the alarm setting, okay? So now you're in the alarm mode, let's call it. Still have the time, the time hasn't changed and you haven't set, and you haven't set the time up for the alarm. So after you hit the M button, okay? We hit the M button here. Now we're in the alarm mode. Now we wanna S, we wanna set the, the alarm. So that's how that works. So let's go to the S button. I think I got this right. <clears throat> Hit the S button. So now you can see here the alarm button is flashing and the hour is flashing. So that means it's asking you what time you want to wake up. So that's how that works. So you say seven o'clock, eight o'clock, and you hit the up and down buttons here to adjust the time up and adjust the time down. Okay, so that's how that works. And then once you have your time, <clears throat> excuse me, once you have your time set, the hour, and then you want the minute set. You hit the S button again. Nope, see? <clears throat> even I don't even get it. Did I hit the S button? Nope, I think I hit the up button by mistake. Okay, let's just put that back down. Buttons are confusing. So they, I hit the S button for set. <clears throat> so that's set the hour. And now you want the minute. So what time do you want the alarm clock to go off? So that's what we want to do. Okay, so at the 7.20, let's, here's the buttons in the back again. So you have the up and the down, okay? So let's see. So we're gonna do seven, let's say 727, okay? And then once we hit that, we hit the S button. Again, S is for Sam, okay? Now the snooze comes up. You want the snooze to, how long you want the snooze to be on for? This is what it's asking you for the snooze. Again, up and down arrows. So you can have the snooze for two, every two minutes the snooze will go off, every three minutes the snooze will go off. You can just keep going up and down for the snooze. So every four minutes the alarm will go off again for the snooze. So let's say every four minutes we want the, the alarm to keep going off till we wake up every four minutes. So once you do that, you hit the S button again and that sets the snooze time. Okay, I'm not sure what the one means. I didn't figure that out yet. So I'll skip over that. I don't know if someone else knows about that. Leave a comment below if you know what the one is for. I'm not, there's really no one and two. If you have one person or two people, that makes sense. 
but there isn't anything else. So then I go back here. So now the alarm is set for seven. Okay, we already set the time. It's a four minute snooze. Now the alarm is set. Okay, now we go back. Yep. Let's see here one second here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, that's what that sounds. Those are the different tones you can choose. Okay, now we just figure this out together. Isn't that cool? These are the different sounds. Crazy sounds, but okay. So this, this, is a, this is a cool sound, right? Okay, those are the different sounds. All right, so now we know what that means. Okay, whatever. So you, those are the different sounds. So we figure that out together. So once you figure out the sound you want, hit the S button to set that. Now that's all set. All right, so your alarm is set. It's gonna go off. Okay, you get the snooze button, the alarm button. And let's go back here. All right, that's that. That's that. And that's that. Okay, so this alarm's all set. It's gonna go off. Now, if the, snoo if the alarm goes off, the snooze button, so you know, is the M button. Again, the M button is the snooze button. So when you wake up, you can, if you can see the M button, if you're awake, you hit the M button and the snooze will, the alarm will shut off and it'll go back on again. So that's how that works. So pretty much this is how it works. So if you're in this mode here and you see this, this means the alarm is on. This is gonna set to go off automatically all the time. Okay. And then you have the sound, hit the, hit the button, hit the uh, M button again. And this is the music and it sets for the snooze. So the alarm is set, it's gonna play music and it's gonna have the snooze. So that's what that means. Those are those, those are the symbols mean. So the alarm is set to go off, it tells you that. It's gonna play a song, it tells you that. And the snooze is set. So you can have the snooze on, the snooze off. See, just music only, okay? And then hit, hit the M again. And this is music and then the snooze button or off, or off altogether. I'm not really sure what that means, but we'll figure it out as we go along. So that's the basic fundamental behind the crazy alarm clock. So that's how that works. So let's go back here. Music off, and let's go back to M. So the M will shut out. Now, when that's not highlighted, <clears throat> that means the alarm is on again, just the M button. So when you want to go to bed and you want to set the alarm for the next morning, hit the M button and your alarm is set. To shut it off, you hit the M button again and it shuts it off. So. When this, is on, when, this, when this alarm is on, that means the alarm is all set to go. Then you hit the S button. I know it's confusing, I get it. The S button is for the sound and the snooze. So that's off. Okay, so now you know it's all set up for the alarm and the sound. It's very complicated, I get it, but I'm just trying to help you out as much as I can here. And then that, so once you got these all set up, you know it's gonna be music and it's gonna be snooze. You already have those pre-programmed already. So all you have to do is hit the M button to turn it on in the M button again to shut it off. So I hope I clarified this for you. I try to figure it out as best I can for these crazy things. People are emailing all the time and sending tons of messages with this crazy alarm. So hopefully I made a little bit of sense. The instructions are useless. They tell you nothing. It's an absolute waste of time. Like someone made a comment in the last post that I did. They said a seven year old came out a manual better than what they gave you. There's just no information whatsoever. So I hope I gave you some information. So clarify um, any questions at all please leave some comments below um, if you enjoyed this video and this and I gave you some and I uh, if you learned something from the video if I gave you some value I do appreciate it. if you do subscribe to my channel it really helps me out quite a bit and that does support what I do all right guys so I hope you learned a little bit again about the art light how to set the time for the alarm and shut it off and shut it on if you have any other questions at all I can help you uh, please feel free to just send messages down below and I'll be glad to I always answer everybody's questions 100% and that's what I do. So um, I appreciate it. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Again, I appreciate your time. Don't forget to subscribe and also like the video. If you like the video, it helps more people see the video. That helps me as well. So the more you like, the more you share, the more you subscribe, the more I can keep doing this and helping you guys. All right, that's it for me. I appreciate it again, and I'll see you at the next review.